I again. In the book of James, James addresses quarrels and fighting, especially among brothers in the church. James chapter 4 verses 1 and 2, what's causing the quarrels and fights among you? Don't they come from the evil desires at war within you? You want what you don't have, so you scheme and kill to get it. You're jealous of what others have, but you can't get it, so you fight and wage war to take it away from them. Yet you don't have what you want because you don't ask God for it. James seems to be saying to the church at large that quarrels, fighting among us, stems from a basic covetousness. It stems from sin. It stems from the essence of sin, from selfishness. This season, as we look at the political views that we have, what are we looking for? Are we looking for something that benefits ourself? Or are we looking for the good of people at large? Are we looking for the other person's good? Or just for our own? Now, we need to look for our own good, but not at the cost of the good of others. So this season, as we judge between the many different viewpoints that are out there, let's remember that covetousness is not a good place to start from. Start from a desire for the best for the other person. Weigh carefully the choices that we'll be making in the election booth in a month. Pray about them. When James finishes this passage, he brings it back to God. You don't have what you want because you don't ask God for it. So today, are you, in addition to talking about the election, are you praying about the election? We need to be. Spend some time in prayer for what will take place on November the 2nd. God bless you. I look forward to talking to you again tomorrow.